Quick, check this out. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how you can actually use ChatGPT in carrying out your schoolwork. When I mean schoolwork, I mean your school activities like your school essays, school assignments, school presentations, school report writing, school design concepts, name it, whichever schoolwork you can actually think of. Okay, in terms of writing, I'm going to show you guys how you can actually use ChatGPT in doing this activity. And yeah, in addition to this, I'm also going to be showing you guys how you can actually use this knowledge or this skill in actually making money online. You know, I'm going to show you guys the most realistic way Way of actually making money online through this method and yeah before we hop into what we have for today's video if you're new to my youtube channel you see my face for the very first time kindly subscribe and also give this video a thumbs up as i'm sure in today's video you're gonna learn a lot so without wasting much more time let's hop into the main tutorial so first things first i'm gonna be showing you guys how you can actually use chat gpt to write your school essays okay so a lot of you might be asking me how is chat gpt gonna write a first person essay for me how does chat gpt even know what happened to me in my life okay so basically what you want to do is the idea is you want to ask ChatGPT to write you an essay in a first person method okay you're going to ask ChatGPT write me a first person essay or a first person descriptive essay narrative essay expository essay whichever type of essay you want to write okay so you're asking ChatGPT write me a narrative essay on this incident in a first person format okay for example let me show you guys okay let's say I want to write an essay based on a narrative essay based on an accident the accord or something okay so i'm basically gonna say write me an essay or write me a narrative essay in first person about an accident okay so this is what you want to do as you can see ChatGPT is going to answer you in, in a first person way okay looking like as you can see it was a typical wednesday morning and i was on my way to work as you can see ChatGPT basically wrote this narrative essay in the first person format as you can see over here it was a typical Wednesday morning and I was on my way to work. The sun was just starting to peek through the clouds. Okay, like we said about an accident. So ChatGPT already gave us a very good, you know, narrative essay based on this. So basically all you want to do is to copy this. Okay, you're basically copying this. Ctrl C. Okay, you can open your Microsoft Word, whichever, you know, documents, you know, way document file you want to use okay and you want to paste this and then start adding adjustments okay based on what actually happened to you in reality okay for example let's say it was you know not drinking let's say it was smoking you can just adjust this in your microsoft word okay so let me show you guys real time what i mean by this okay so let's say i'm going to open or even notepad okay okay i'm going to use notepad okay let's say i open notepad i'm going to paste this okay Control V, as you can see, and then I basically just want to adjust the part that says drinking over here. So I can just make it smoking, all right? So basically, that's what you want to do, okay? You're basically asking ChatGPT to write to this essay in a first person, you know, method, and then you're basically making adjustments if it's actually necessary or in places you feel you should, you know, change things, okay? So with these, you can actually just write your school essays in just a few minutes. As you can see, this is this didn't even take me up to 60 seconds, okay? So you're basically asking ChatGPT to write you a narrative essay or descriptive essay, whichever type of essay, and immediately ChatGPT provides this essay. And if you feel this is not long enough, you know, we have essays that tells you you need to write this amount of words, you can actually ask ChatGPT, make it longer, make it longer. Okay, so ChatGPT is gonna, you know. We create this and make it longer as you can see ChatGPT is going to make it longer okay so this is basically how you can use ChatGPT to write your essays whether it's a narrative essay descriptive essay whichever type of essay and then you're doing this in a very few minutes so now moving on to the next thing i have for today's tutorial is going to be on how to use ChatGPT to write presentations okay for example powerpoint presentations all you want to do is okay i have a title okay probably on uh whichever title okay it could be on oxygen it could be on 
whichever thing, name it, okay? I'm just going to use oxygen for this example for today's video, okay? I want to write a presentation on how oxygen works in life, okay? In reality, how does oxygen work, you know, about oxygen, the properties of oxygen, okay, in the atmosphere. So I'm basically just going to ask ChatGPT, write me, write me a presentation, okay? A presentation in form of powerpoint okay you can be powerpoint or you can just go direct write my presentation okay in form of powerpoint or you can say powerpoint slides about oxygen so it all depends on whichever title you want so you basically just want to do this exact thing i just did on my screen right now write my presentation in form of powerpoint slides about oxygen as you can see chat gpt is actually generating this for me slide one the introduction okay oxygen okay the element that keeps us alive and if you want you know a more explanatory format all you want to do is to ask chat gpt okay tell me more about slide three okay let me stop this and as you can see tell me more about slide three as you can see chat gpt is going to explain the slide three for me it's going to explain it in a better form okay so basically all you're doing is to copy this as you can see sources of oxygen it's explaining sources of oxygen in a more you know advanced format okay so basically all you want to do is to copy this and then go to your powerpoint or whichever presentation you want to use it's going to be google presentation whichever one and then you just want to paste this okay you want to paste it in slide one paste this in slide two whichever way so this is how you can actually use chat gpt for your school presentations in just few minutes i didn't even use up to one minute i just asked chat gpt and that was it so basically all you're doing is to copy this go to that you know powerpoint software whichever one and then you paste and indeed and then you're done okay so now moving on to the next thing for today's video is going to be on design concept or you know project writing report writing whichever writing reports projects whichever one okay i know a lot of people out there you know in school and all those things you have projects right you know it's a long project you just want to do something quick and please note, I am not saying you should just use ChatGPT Ultra. Yeah, you can use ChatGPT. It's a fast means, but still, you all want to add your ideas as well, okay? Do not just rely on ChatGPT. Don't be addicted to ChatGPT. You should also try and input your own ideas into what ChatGPT gives you, okay? So now, let's proceed. Basically, all you want to do is to ask ChatGPT, write me a report or give me a report writing based on this topic, depending on your topic, okay? And the same thing applies, okay? You might say how would chat gpt even know the type of design i'm doing how does chat gpt know the measurement i made on this equipment you know basically all you're doing is you're asking chat gpt in a general way and then you're making this adjustment okay or basically you can ask chat gpt in a specific way based on that particular report you want to do based on that topic you want to do and then chat gpt is going to give you in the best of all ways and then you're basically making adjustments for example write me a report or give me a report writing writing on whichever let's say the government government of germany germany i'm just thinking of anything that comes to my head okay i made a spelling error whichever as you can see the government of germany is a federal it's basically going to give you these namings it could be a report writing it could be your project right if it's a project let's say you have a project on you know building these or projects on fabricating this or a project on a social project whichever one you can just ask chat gpt write me a project a project report okay so you can just say write me a project report on name it oh my god i can't actually think of okay let's just say project report on fabrication fabrication of a spoon okay as you can see chat gpt is before i talk chat gpt is going to give me the you know project report so basically immediately chat gpt provides this all you're doing is you're making the adjustment okay you're reading through as you can see introduction it's going to give you the format you know the correct format for the report writing and then give you a good explanation okay 
So as you can see, ChatGPT is already giving me the introduction, okay? And then it's gonna continue. And then if you want more, you basically wanna ask ChatGPT, give me more, give me more based on the design, give me more based on the introduction, and then you're done. As you can see, I'm not even wasting time. I am doing this in just a few minutes. All I need to do after this, immediately ChatGPT is done, is to copy this, paste it in my Microsoft Word, paste it in whichever document, you know, format you wanna use, and then you edit, adjust some things, and you're done. And now moving on to the final thing for today's video is going to be on how you can actually make money through this. OK, like I said in the beginning of today's video, the most realistic way, although we have so many websites out there where you can actually go and you know register as a tutor and then you answer questions, help students and then you make your money. For example, we have Guru.com, we have StudyPool, whichever. There's so many, so many websites. But the realistic way you can actually make money online through this is by actually creating a business, okay? Business based on helping students in writing essays, helping students writing presentations. They basically give you the detailed aspect of the report writing or the presentations. And then you're basically using ChatGPT to actually create this writing. Probably it's an essay on this or essay about the government, essay about the country. You're basically asking ChatGPT to generate these and then you paste it in your Microsoft Word, edit it, and then once you're done, you know, you want to want to ensure you're charging in a very good distance amount, okay? You charge them, and then you're basically using ChatGPT to do this, and then you're getting paid for this. This is actually the most realistic and quickest way of actually making money online through this method by actually, you know, advertising yourself, okay? I am doing students, I'm helping students in making essays, writing essays, writing presentations, name it, whichever one, and then they pay you for doing it, and are basically using chat gpt to actually write this so guys there you have it that brings us to the end of today's video if you surely learned a lot from today's video and you still haven't subscribed make sure to subscribe and also give this video a thumbs up as i am sure you've actually learned a lot from today's video and yeah i'll see you guys in my next video